all praises to Yahweh, Bashem, Yahweh Shai, double honor to Apostle and Elders in New York. And citation of Akim, that's um, put, teaching the truth and putting your lives on the line for it. And shalom to you, serious uh, Akwaf, that's uh, learning from the videos. My name is Maya Ka'ala Button God. Like I make a disclaimer first that we're not black. Hebrew is like black is a color, not a nationality. All right. Nobody walking around is, is the color of tar. Okay. There is lights are the so called Negroes, Latinos, and Native American speckled birds scattered abroad. Speckled birds are Israelites who look like other nations. But their fathers, um, put turn the blood that go back to the 12 tribes of Israel. We are not fitting with any black identity string groups. We are not fitting with any Islamic groups. We are not fitting with any Israelite groups. All right. So this is just a quick hit, man, to this false doctrine that, uh, that, that, uh, only three three uh tribes of Israel was scattered around the earth, Judah, Benjamin, Levi, because that's impossible because the whole nation of Israel was given uh the law, statute, commandments, and was given the blessings and was given the curses. The blessings if they do obey the law, statute, commandments of Yahweh, you know, our true power. All right. And and um the curses of the curses or, or the consequence will have you disobey. So how can only three tribes be scattered, man? That's a false doctrine. The only three tribes uh, uh, scattered is a false doctrine that the black only Israelites came up with because they can't handle the truth that the, uh, the uh, so-called Native Americans, the so-called Latinos are, are part of the, the nation of Israel. All right. So let's, let's qu uh, quickly knock, knock this, uh, that, that false doctrine out, man. All right, it says, uh, Exodus chapter 19, verse 1, it said, The third month, when the children of Israel were going forth out of the land of Egypt, Exodus 19, 1, all right, going forth out of the land of Egypt, the same day they came to the wilderness of Sinai. For they departed from uh, Repentin and were come to the desert of Sinai, and they had pitched in the wilderness, and there Israel camped before the mount. And Moses went up unto the Most High, and Yahweh called unto him out of the mountain, saying, Thus shalt thou say to the house of Jacob, tell the children of Israel, You have seen what I had did unto the Egyptians, and how I bear you on eagle wings, and brought you unto myself. Now therefore, if you will obey my voice indeed, and keep my covenant, then you shall be a peculiar treasure unto me above all people, for all the earth is mine. You shall be unto me a kingdom of priests, a holy nation, these are the words which thou shalt speak unto the children of Israel. That's all to a tribe, children of Israel. And Moses came and called for the elders of the people and laid before their faces all these words which Yahweh commanded. And all the people together and said, All that Yahweh has spoken, we will do. And Moses returned to the words of the people unto Yahweh. So they made an agreement right there, man. All right, all 12 tribes. Okay. Let's see right here. Let's go to uh all right, your Psalms 14719. All right. It says uh Psalms 14719. He showed his word unto Jacob, his statutes, and the judgments unto Israel, all twelve tribes. He hath not dealt with so so with any nation, as for his judgment, they have not known them. Praise ye Yahweh. All right. It didn't say uh, he showed his word unto Judah and Benjamin and Levi. All right. That's impossible, man. All right. Then you go to what? Deuteronomy uh, 28. All right. Let's see what he's talking to Israel right here. It said, and shall come to pass, if thou shalt hearken diligent to the voice of Yahweh thy power, to observe to do his commandments, which I command you this day, that Yahweh thy power will set thee high above all nations of the earth. He's talking to Israel. All right. Let's get the blessing, the blessings in Deuteronomy, from Deuteronomy 21, verse 15. Then from, um, sorry, it's a lot. Deuteronomy 21 and uh, 14. All right. Um. All right, then you go right here, Deuteronomy 21, 15 to 68. It shows you the curse. If you disobey, what's one of the curses? You should be what? Go right here. All right, it says uh, Deuteronomy 28 and uh, 
64, it says, it shall come to pass that as Yahweh will rejoice, uh, uh, let me go ahead, Salak, Deuteronomy 20, 64, and Yahweh shall scatter thee among all people from one end of the earth, even to the other, and there thou shalt serve other, other gods, which neither thou nor, thou nor thy fathers had known, even wood and stone. All right, so there you go, man. Then you go right here, Deuteronomy 2, it says, what? Well, Yahweh shall bring thee into Egypt again, with ships, by the way, I spake, by the way, I spake on, spake on to thee, all right? We was in a uh, physical uh, uh, Africa, all right? America is spiritual Egypt. And also this Egypt, uh, 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 it also mean uh, captivity, Deuteronomy chapter 5, verse 6, all right? Because guess what? The, uh, the uh, so-called ha uh, Haitians, they didn't go to... <laughs> Uh, they end up on um, Hispaniola, which is now Domin uh, Haiti and Dominic Republic. That's not America, all right? So the city of Egypt is double folded, man, all right? It says, um, Thou shalt see it no more again, all right? The whole nation of Israel, we shouldn't, all 12 tribes, we shouldn't see the whole land of Israel again. And there you should be sold unto your enemies for bondmen and bondwomen. The Most High gave us up unto, to our enemies, all right? And we end up on the auction blocks, being sold to slay, and no man should bite, nobody should save us. All right, we have to we have to serve that uh that punishment, man, for you know, which is slowly coming off of us in the corner of Deuteronomy 30, verse 7. All right, and then you go right here. This will get another one. All right, and these people, man, they don't they don't study, man. They wet behind the ears. All right, they so uh, anti-camp, and it's really uh, we a great millstone. We don't, we don't uh, cap cap bang, man. All right, only time we'll come against somebody, uh, somebody that's a person or a camp, but they teaching the wrong doctrine. All right, because we deal with uh, men of valor, DTA. All right, they they not GMS, but we teach the same the same doctrine, man. All right. It says right here, it said Deuteronomy chapter 4, verse 27, saying, Yahweh shall scatter you among nations, and ye shall be left and few number among the heathen, whether Yahweh shall leave you. All right, so we should be scattered, man, among, among the nations. He's talking to who? Israel. Because if you go up, all right, and you can could, you could see right here, he's talking to Israel, man. All right. He's talking to Israel. It said, for what nation so great who have the most high so nigh unto as Yahweh, our powers and all things that we call upon him for? What nation there so great has statute and judgment so righteous all this all this law which I set before you this day? All right. <laughs> okay, so you see right here, he's talking to the nation of Israel. He's not talking to right here. Therefore, hearken, O Israel, he talking to all twelve tribes, unto the statutes and judgments which I teach you, for to do them that ye may live and go in and possess the land which Yahweh, Yahweh, of uh, power, Yahweh of your fathers had, fathers, which Yahweh of your fathers had given you. All right. So uh, you know, there, there you go, man. All right. All right. All right. Uh, all right. So there you go. Uh, all right. Get this off of me. All right. All right, so it's, you, you know Yahweh Allah, 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 all right? All right. So I'm the uh, happy Heavenly Father, all right? But anyway, uh, let me see. Uh, go right here, Jeremiah. And this the the icing on the cake right here. It's going to destroy that uh, the final nail in the coffin. It says right here, Jeremiah 3.18, In those days, the house of Judah, 
the southern kingdom shall walk with the house of Israel, the northern kingdom, and they shall come together out of the land of the north to the land that I, that I have given for an inheritance unto your fathers. All right. So who's the land of the north? It's America, man. It's America. All right. <clears throat> okay. Then you go right here. You can have some. See, one zero one. All right. Because people talk, oh, it says it's going to few. No, that's only for a short time. It's going to be a few, man. All right. The call number is going to go down for a while. And it said, Israel says what? You're going to uh, be as the sand of the sea. It's uh, Hosea chapter 1, verse 10. Yet the number of children shall be as sand of the sea. Okay. How many people could count the sand of the sea? Which cannot be measured, no number. It shall come to pass in that place where it said unto you, ye are not my people. Right, because here in America, what they saying? You so-called neo-Latino name, right? You ain't, you ain't the Israelites. You got Israelites saying, uh, calling the other Israelites, saying they not Israelites. All right. Uh, there should be said on to them, ye are the sons of the living power. All right, you are the Israelites. All right, you so-called Negroes, Latino Native America. Then shall the children of Judah and the children of Israel be gathered together and point themselves one head, and they shall come up out of land, for great shall be the day of Jezreel. All right, because this is going to be uh, another aspect, but it's going to be greater than, you know, this, this our, uh, when we get saved out of this uh, this prison called America, it's going to be uh, it's going to be greater than the this than, than uh, uh, Egypt. You know, over there in Africa, when, when Moses came, when Moses, when uh, Yahweh sent Moses to come, Moses and Aaron to come get us out of there, man. All right, so this smash this doctrine, this false doctrine that only uh, three tribes were scattered: Judah, Benjamin, Levi, man. All right, which is uh, <laughs> was just totally, totally out of ignorance, man. People don't don't understand scriptures. All right. And, and, you know, willfully want to be it because they can't accept the fact that the so-called Native Americans and Latinos are the Israelites that the Bible speaks of. So, Shalom.